I realize that some of you may be thinking, that's really not professional. What's, what's going on with the shades? Or some of you may be thinking, what are you hiding? I have nothing to hide except for a jacked up eye. <laughs> so I'm keeping the shades on. All right. Uh, I got a video I want to share with you. This video is just an exercise, a simple exercise you can check out to try to open up your airway, your breathing, your, di your connection between your lungs and your diaphragm. And also make you aware of how you're using the exchange of draw and blow notes. Um, I think those are the main benefits of this. But I started doing this just, I was noodling around on the harmonica and it just started happening. And I thought, I need to share this. I think it's a cool thing to share. Um, by the way, let me quickly mention I'm headed to Florida this coming Saturday. I'll be in Pensacola. I think it's Blue Angel Music. I'll list all of the music stores. Then Monday through Wednesday, I'll be in the Tampa area, Tampa, Sarasota, and Clearwater. So if you're in those areas or you're around those areas and you want to join a road show, it's basically coming out to these music stores. Um, the other ones will be Sam Ash stores. And we will have a good time learning a little bit about the harmonica and the Honer harmonica line. So the different models I'm going to demonstrate and play a couple tunes for you. The exercise is simple. You just can't stop breathing. Now, normally you wouldn't do this in your playing. You take breaks and take the harmonica out. But I think you're going to find that this exercise teaches you. It'll influence your phrasing so that when you are not, not going to take the break, how do, you, how do you use your exchange to keep going? Long notes, then long blows, you know, long draw and long blows, or rapid fire exchanges or a mix. So what I'm going to do is just demo it first. I'm just going to play I've got an A harmonica, and the only rule is you can't stop breathing. Just see what happens when you try it. What are the benefits for you? And, and then I'll, when I'm done, I'll talk a little bit more about it. Harp jammed on me. All right, so what happens is you find your moments where you're naturally sort of like, I need a breath right here. And then you have the opportunity. Again, you could have stopped taking the breath. But there's something about what do you do when the harp doesn't come out? How can you – how does that affect the, the, your phrasing and all of that? So just being aware of, of getting used to being breathing through the harmonica musically. is There's something really powerful about, about doing this. <laughs> Because you get a, a better sense for the relationship, given the scale, you know, the relationship to the scale and how that the certain notes fall out. Um, so yeah, well, I think that that if you just try this exercise and go through it, you'll you'll see some benefits. Um, and there's there's just something I can't put my finger on really, but I know that uh, getting your lungs and your diaphragm open alone. By not taking the harp out, getting used to just breathing and exchanging, it's just something will click, I think, for certain people. It started to happen when I was doing it. And you can just really take a groove and work on that.
and what's interesting is that you shouldn't be out of breath. And it teaches you a way to, again, control your air. That's that is, that's really what it is. The benefit is that you start to become aware of how this muscle, this diaphragm, is really working with your lungs. And when you do that, like, I don't feel out of breath at all right now. I feel energized. It should make you feel, you know, if anything, give you that sort of lift. Uh, that's what I'm trying to communicate. So get that muscle working. F see what it feels like when you're, when you're playing. You don't get to stop. You should be able to find that sweet spot of exchanging air through idea, musical ideas, you know, those blow notes, you know, long draws. So that's what I'm trying to get out. That's all I got. I hope to see you guys at a road show. I may or may not have my shades on at the time. There's something to say for looking somebody in the eye, especially when your eye is not jacked up. Why is my eye jacked up? I don't know. Allergies. All right, my friends. I hope to see you real soon. Thanks for tuning in.